Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Fresh details are emerging when it comes to William Ruto's visit in Nyanza region. The details that we are receiving is that before William Ruto landed in Homa Bay today in Nyanza region, Raila Odinga had already called, had a phone call to all leaders from Homa Bay County because it was believed that William Ruto was going to start his tour from Homa Bay going to Siaya. But it is about three days tour, which according to my opinion, Raila Odinga, according to the reports that we are getting, is that Raila Odinga directed that all elected leaders from Nyanza region must be present at William Ruto's uh, tour. If it is about Homa Bay County, be it senators, be it women rep, be it governor, be it MCS, be it member of parliament, must attend. And the way, of course, I'm dis displaying pictures, people who could have not attended William Ruto's uh, meeting or visit in Nyanza region, they have come out openly attending William Ruto's meeting in Nyanza region. When you look at people like Milise, um, people like Gladys Wanga, people like Milio Diambo, the senator of Oma Bay County, Kajuan, women rep that was elected, and certain and several member of parliament. And I want to give you a secret. This could have not happened if Raelu Dinga today could have called them and told them that you should not attend that meeting. And mark my words, if Raila Odinga could have had a phone call to them and told them that no one should attend the visit of William Ruto, then they could have not been present in those meetings. But because of the reports that we are getting, is that Raila Odinga has given an authority that all elected leaders must attend William Ruto's visit. And I want us to have a critical analysis. The reason why Raila Odinga has now come out to have different tricks and tactics on how he's going to lead Nyanza region. Because there are several issues that has been raised in accordance to the leadership of Raila Amolo Odinga. So before we do that, ladies and gentlemen, if you are a visitor for this first time and you have not subscribed to this channel, please just do me a favor. Ensure that you subscribe to this channel. You put on the notification bell that when I upload my videos like this, you get notified automatically by YouTube. For those who are returning subscribers, I want to appreciate you so much because of the wonderful job that you are doing. Please don't forget to like this video. When you like this video, you support this, vi this video automatically. Now, Raila Odinga, in accordance to the news that we received, is that Raila Odinga holds a meeting with the Nyanza region leaders before William Ruto today landed in Homa Bay as he start his Nyanza three days tour. As we expect him to visit several counties in Nyanza region. And the meeting of Raila Odinga with these so-called leader, elected leaders, gave a different picture on William Ruto's three days tour. Because Raila Odinga came out the other time well in Mombasa, he said that no one elected leader should come out to say that we are not going to work with the national government. We are not going to work with William Ruto because I'm in Azimio, because I'm in ODM. Let elected leaders work with William Ruto. Working with William Ruto 
does not change anything that you are not coming from Azimio. Does not change anything that you are coming from Odeon. The way that Raila Odinga is playing a tactics is that Raila, number one, he wants to block these people that were coming against him, that was blocking William Ruto to visit Nyanza. I don't know if you have understand, uh, understood that point. Because uh, earlier on, there were certain leaders, people like Kidero, people like Okotobado, people like Eliud Owalo, who is a cabinet secretary of ICT, people like the former governor of Kisumu, Ranguma, and many other leaders. Certain of them came out, ganging up against Raila Odinga, that in any case he was going to block William Ruto to visit, uh, of course, Nyanza region, then they were going to lead William Ruto. Now, William Raila Odinga has played a very smart trick that, look, I have my allies that were elected in Azimio. I want them to lead William Ruto in his three days tour. Not these two democrats, people like Kidero. Imagine today, when you look at the governor of uh, Homabe, if today you could have not accepted to accompany William Ruto in his tour in Homa Bay County, then it means Kidero could have chipped in. Are you understanding something that I'm bringing in? Kidero could have chipped in, then it could have been seen like Kidero is senior as someone that is preferred for William Ruto to lead Homa Bay County. But now, through a phone call and a meeting of Raila Odinga, has changed everything. Now, allies of Raila Odinga are the ones that leading Raila Odinga in touring Nyanza region, which according to me, it is a great strategy and a smarter trick that Raila Odinga is playing to ensure that he's blocking these tumba crafts that are likely arising when he is planning to block William Ruto. Number two is Raila Odinga is um, of course, does not want to um, bring a commotion between county governments and national government. Currently, William Ruto is the president and he is leading national government. When it comes to the county governments, Raila Odinga is having his allies that were elected in Azimio. So he must give a space for them to work together. Then in any case, times will come then they will reorganize, reorganize themselves because time is now for working. Number three is that Raila Odinga does not have these dirty claims that, oh, we could have had this development, we could have benefited from William Ruto's government, Raila Odinga did that, this and this. And now, because of the claims that came out from those tumbocrats and these failures from Nyanza politics, like Hidero, like people, um, uh, Raguma, the former governor of Kisumu, they were driving very vigorous movement to um, get out Raila, uh, to, to of course uh, remove Raila Odinga's um, popularity in Nyanza region. So now I think whatever Raila Odinga is doing is very clear, very clear. He does not want this dirty claim that has been there that Raila Odinga is the one that has been blocking the develop development. Now Raila Odinga has been. He's sitting now at a distance, telling them, you must work with this government. You must work with this, this government. And that is why you see people like Milio Diambo, who have not been even attending that. I want to tell you, if today Raila could have been telling them that, don't attend that meeting. After Milio Diambo ange kuwa kwa hiyo meeting. Milio Diambo is there. Senator of Oma Beu is there. Governor is there. So which room can Kidero chip in? To be close to William Ruto. So that is the trick that Raila Odinga is playing. Very smart trick. So that he can remain relevant. That he did not block William Ruto. So ladies and gentlemen. I want to ask you a simple question. Are you seeing something greatly Raila Odinga is playing. When it comes to the Nyanza politics. Because everything is politics. Everything is politics. Politics is the order of the day. What are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? Do you support Raila Odinga after his meeting yesterday with the Nyanza region leaders to attend William Ruto's uh, tour 
Is it a good idea? Then you can drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, thank you so much because of great support. Please consider liking, commenting, and share the, sharing this video. And most thing, don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye till you meet on another video.